If it ain't one thing, it's another. Here we go again. Carson Wentz. You guys already know by now. He hurt his foot. And um, today we got the update on what's going to be happening with him from our head coach, Frank Reich. He announced today that Carson Wentz will be out 5 to 12 weeks after having surgery on his foot. So he's going to miss some games. Um, there's no telling when he'll exactly be back, what month. I don't know, but he's going to miss some games. We signed Brett Huntley, who's been, you know, from team to team. We signed him to the quarterback room. We drafted Sam Ellinger um, in the draft this year. And we got Jacob Eason, who we drafted last year in the draft. So if I had to bet on it, Jacob Eason will probably be our quarterback to start the season. And we... I, we, we haven't seen anything from him. We haven't seen anything from him because last year there wasn't any preseason. But the preseason starts this week. Preseason starts this week. So I'm excited to see what happens and how he plays because, like I said, Carson Wentz, we know his injury history since coming into the draft. When he's with Philly, he tore his ACL. He's been having injury after injury. And he's a talented quarterback. Carson Wentz is good. I'm telling you. He had his struggles last year on a bad Eagles team. The offense wasn't good. The defense wasn't that great either. It was better than the offense. But let's just be real. Overall, that Eagles team wasn't good. Okay? Let's just put it like that. It's not all on Carson Wentz. I'm telling y'all. But he's a good quarterback. That's why I really wanted him to come here. But now with this news... Who knows what's going to happen in the future. Foot injuries are scary. Y'all know Yao Ming, NBA Hall of Famer. He had a foot injury. It shortened his career. He could have been better than what he actually was. But he came out an eight-time NBA All-Star. Like I say, he's in the Hall of Fame, the Basketball Hall of Fame. So, foot injuries are scary. So, I'm kind of nervous. I don't know what to expect. Once he comes back healthy, who's to say he doesn't get hurt again? It was risky trading for him, but I believe it was the right move. I still do. I still believe when he comes back, he's going to be great. He has a better team. He has a much better offense, a much better defense, better coaching, just an all-around better environment. He already said that he's happy to be here and that this feels like a family. So I'm hoping great things happen for Carson Wentz and Indy. But this is just a bump in the road. We're going to have to deal with it. I made a post saying that whoever's our quarterback, I don't really want to watch the games unless it's Carson Wentz. I know that sucks to say as a Colts fan, but I just, I was banking on him to be starting the season. I, I was so excited. I'm not excited to watch Jacob Easton. I'm not excited to watch Brett Huntley. He sucks. I'm not excited to see Seb Ellinger to get thrown out there if that was to happen. Which I doubt. Like I said, most likely it'll be Jacob Eason. I don't want to have this video go too much further. Carson Wentz, when you get back, I need you to stay healthy. Be great. You don't have to do too much. You have an offense. You have a running game. You don't have to force turnovers just be a game manager I don't care but you have to succeed here because it's not only going to look bad on you it's going to look bad on us for taking a chance on you we're trying to revive your career you were almost MVP in 2017 if you didn't get hurt you would have won MVP you was the favorite we got to get you back to that point and I believe this is the team to do that. So with that being said, I'm going to end this video off here. Just another small bump in the road, like I said. The NBA, free agency, it officially starts today at 6 p.m. I probably will be back up here again. You might be seeing my face again because those signings, a lot of rumors is going to be heating up today. Today is a big day. It's a big week overall, like I said, with the NFL preseason starting. 
Thursday, you got the Cowboys and the Steelers kicking off the NFL Hall of Fame game on Fox. Whew, big week, big week ahead. But Carson Wentz, get healthy, bro. See you back soon. I'm out. Peace.